Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a recent article by AZE Media, dated May 6, 2024, it was revealed that Excalibur Army, a Czech defense company, is set to dispatch more than 70 units of the 155mm-L45 Dita self-propelled howitzers to Azerbaijan. This transaction marks the most substantial order of Czech or Slovak artillery systems since 1989. This move comes following Excalibur Army's prior delivery of 152mm Dana M1 self-propelled howitzers and 122mm RM-70 M1 Vampire MLRS to Azerbaijan in September 2021, as detailed in a report from September 21, 2021. The Dita 155mm, an 8x8 self-propelled howitzer developed by Excalibur Army, is strategically designed to tackle modern artillery challenges. Stemming from the Tatra 8x8 truck-mounted howitzer designs, it boasts a fully automated superstructure, necessitating only a driver and commander on board. January 2021 marked the completion of a functional prototype, setting the stage for performance testing. The Dita made its inaugural appearance at IDEX 2021 in Abu Dhabi, showcased in collaboration with the UAE-based Edge Group. With dimensions measuring 13.02 meters in length, 3.08 meters in width, and 3.12 meters in height, and weighing up to 29 tons, the Dita exhibits versatility, capable of being mounted on various wheeled or track chassis. Its ballistic crew cabin offers Stanag 4569 Level 1 protection and is equipped with a high-performance heating, air conditioning, and NBC filtration system. Armed with a NATO standard 155mm L45 gun, the Dita can engage targets up to 39 km away using he BB shells, achieving a maximum rate of fire of 6 rounds per minute. It supports various firing modes and can store 40 rounds in its turret conveyors. The DITA incorporates the capability of multiple round simultaneous impact, MRSI, a feature seen in modern artillery systems. This allows multiple shells to be fired rapidly but time to hit the target simultaneously, aimed at overwhelming enemy defenses or achieving a concentrated effect. An advanced onboard control system, OCS, governs diagnostics, navigation, automatic gun guiding, and ammunition management for the DITA. Propelled by a Tatra T3C 928-90 engine generating a maximum power output of 300 kW, it can attain speeds of 90 km per hour on roads and 25 km per hour off-road, with a maximum cruising range of 600 km. The DITA prioritizes crew protection, offering Stanag 4569 Level 1 ballistic protection, ensuring crew safety during combat operations. Its sophisticated OCS facilitates swift adjustments in firing position and streamlined operation by just two crew members. In case of a navigation system failure, an emergency optical sight ensures continuous gun aiming capability. In summary, the DITA 155mm marks a significant stride in military mobility and operational adaptability, poised to meet the rigorous demands of modern warfare. According to the Military Balance 2022 report, Azerbaijan currently possesses a diverse artillery arsenal, totaling 630 units. This includes 102 self-propelled artillery pieces, consisting of 46 units of the 122mm 2S1 Gvazdika, 39 units of the 152mm 2S3 Akatsiya, 18 units of the 152mm 2S19 Mstes, and 15 units of the Dana M1M. Additionally, Azerbaijan has five units of the 155mm Atmos 2000 self-propelled howitzer and 12 units of the 203mm 2S7 Pion. The primary objective of the Azerbaijani armed forces is territorial defense, underscored by the resurgence of armed conflicts with Armenia over Nagorno-Karabakh since September 2020. This conflict, spanning six weeks, concluded in favor of Baku, however, tensions between the two nations persist, marked by sporadic exchanges of fire in late 2020 and throughout 2021. Azerbaijan maintains military collaboration with Russia and has recently forged ties with Turkey, as evidenced by the signing of the Shusha Declaration in June 2021, implying a mutual defense agreement. Additionally, Azerbaijan upholds a defense relationship with NATO, having completed its fifth cycle of the NATO Individual Partnership Action Plan in 2019. Preparedness within the Azerbaijani Armed Services, rooted in compulsory military service, varies among units, with the country engaging in multilateral exercises and conducting bilateral drills with Turkish troops, such as the Indestructible Brotherhood, in 2021. 
while the armed forces exhibit limited expeditionary capability, they have contributed to NATO's resolute support mission in Afghanistan. Over the past decade, Azerbaijan has prioritized defense modernization and procurement to replace its aging inventory, with recent orders focusing on air defense, artillery systems, and wheeled and tracked armored vehicles, primarily sourced from Russia. Notably, substantial procurement and industrial cooperation have been established with Israel, particularly in drones and guided weapons, alongside increasing collaboration with Turkey as a key defense partner. That's all for now, see you later.